The following is a class on the Bhagavad Gita as it is. Thirteenth chapter, text number twenty-three. Given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada. Recorded on October twenty-second, 1973, in Bombay, India. Translation. Yet in this body there is another, a transcendental enjoyer, who is the Lord, the Supreme Proprietor, who exists as the overseer and permitter, and who is known as the Super Soul. So, there are two Purushas. One Purusha is already explained. Purusha, Prakitistha, he. Purusha, Prakitistha, he. Bhumte, Prakitijan, Guna. One Purusha, the living entity, Atma. And another Purusha is Paramatma. Sometimes the Mahavadi philosophers, they do not distinguish between Atma and Paramatma. But here it is distinctly explained by the Supreme Personality of Godhead that one Purusha is enjoying the fruits of his activity. Prakitistha uh, means influenced by the quality of the prakriti, material nature. Uh, he is Sadasad Janva Jonishu. He is taking birth in different types and species of life. The another Purusha is there, who is Upodastra. Upodastra means his overseer. He is simply seeing how the other Purusha is working. And according to his karma work, he is giving the result. He is the witness. If the living entity Purusha is working piously, then he is getting a different type of body. Janmai Sadya Sutta Sri, a nice body, <coughs> uh, born in rich man's family, a brahmana's family, scholar's family, Janma. Opulence, aishadya, uh, beauty, beautiful body, and very edu good education. Uh, these distinctions are there because the Paramatma Purusha is observing the activities of the Jivatma Purusha. And according to his karma, according to his desire, he is giving a different type of body. Ishara Sarvam, another place it is said, Ishara Sarvam Bhutanam Vidyesha Arjuna Krishna. That Supreme Personality of Godhead has Paramatma, Antajyami, is situated in everyone's heart. Brahman Sarvam Bhutani, Jantra Rurani Maya. And he is directing Maya to give him a particular type of body and he is moving with that body. Jantra, just like if you, if you get a car, according to the price you can get a car. You can get a Rolls Royce car, Chevrolet car, Cadillac car, or a Ford car, or uh, ambassador car, or a Jeep. So as you can pay for it, you get a different type of path, and you can travel. Similarly, according to your karma, good and bad, you are getting a type of body. There are eight million four hundred thousand species of body. You can get one of them and suffer and endure. 
तथा देहांतर प्राप्ति यू हैव टू चेंज योर बॉडी नेक्स्ट बॉडी यू कैन गेट ए कैश बॉडी ए डॉक्स बॉडी ए थ्रीज बॉडी और ए डेमी गॉड्स बॉडी और ए ब्रह्मास बॉडी और ए इंडियस बॉडी इंडियन बॉडी अमेरिकन बॉडी सैपन बॉडी इंसेक्ट बॉडी बास बॉडी एक्ट एनी एनी नो गारंटी दैट विल बी अवॉर्डेड टू यू अकॉर्डिंग टू योर कॉर्म Unfortunately, they do not know it. Just like animals, the animals do not know how to get a better body. Or they think that they are safe. Look, can stand the zero jati. Brahman B, Purusham Prapyam, Manusham Jama Purja. This is statement in the form of Janma Purja by illusion. We come to this human form of body, and in this human form of body, we have got the chance to develop Krishna consciousness. And if we do not do that, then we are losing the opportunity, missing the opportunity. Next body, I shall get according to my karma. But if you become Krishna conscious in this body, in this human form of body, and if you try to understand what is Krishna, then tapkarde ham punar jarma naiti. Then after giving up this body, you do not accept another material body. This is Krishna consciousness. We are trying to educate men to become Krishna conscious, so that he may not have to accept another material body. So the other body, which is described here, Paramatma, we are Atma and he is Paramatma. We are Ishara, he is Parameshwar. Uh, we are not Parameshwar. Uh, we are Brahma. We follow Brahma. This form of body is huge. Uh, but sometimes men with little in their intelligence, they cannot distinguish between Paramatma and Atma, Parameshwar and Ishwar. Uh, <coughs> you are another. Uh, What is used? Bhokta Maheshwara. We are not Bhokta. We are trying to become Bhokta or enjoy, but we are becoming backward. It is not possible. We cannot become Bhokta. Uh, we can become uh, being enjoyed, predominated. Not the three dominator. It's like one thing is enjoy, and the other is enjoyer. The supreme law is the enjoyer. Both are the two dominators. The two dominators are Maheshwara. Then what again? Maheshwara, Mahaishwara, Mahagin's great. Ishara means controller. So we can control a few men, but Maheshara means he controls all living entities. Nitya nitya na, chetana chetana na. We may be very proud of controlling a factory, a few thousands of workers, but we are not Maheshara. Maheshwara is Krishna, supreme personality of Godhead, who is in his Paramatma feature, is situated in every body. Paramatma it is Cha Opi Upta Dehi Nasmin Nasmin Deh. It is this body. 
खेत्रक खेत्रा खेत्रक गांव दे उन्जुन कॉन्स्टेंस आई थिंक दिस चैप्टर खेत्रम मन जो भी मान भी दी सागो दे ही सुभाग कृष्ण से दैट आई एम ऑल्सो खेत्र द बॉडी इज खेत्र एंड द सोल इज खेत्र ऑफ गॉड वन वुड नो द अबाउट द बॉडी इट्स लाइक यू हैव गॉट योर बॉडी आई हैव गॉट माय बॉडी एंड आई नो इट इज माय बॉडी यू नो इट इज योर बॉडी इट्स लाइक योर अपार्टमेंट your living room similarly there is another partner uh, that is krishna parvatma chitra mancha bhi mangi i can take care of my body i am the owner of this body but krishna is the owner of all bodies that they the landlord and the tenant The tenant is the occupier, and the landlord is the owner. Similarly, I am the occupier of this body, and Krishna Paramatma he is the owner of this body. This is knowledge. I am not the owner of this body. Uh, therefore, Krishna Janardhan name is Rishi Kesha. Rishi means the senses. We are claiming this is my hand, but this is not my hand. This is Krishna's hand. Uh, the same thing. The tenant may occupy the room, but he is not the owner of the room. Owner is different person. Similarly, we may occupy this body. Or any body, but we are not owner of this body. As soon as you know that I am not owner of this body, I am the occupier of this body. That is knowledge. We are falsely claiming that we are owner of this body. We are not owner of this body. I cannot therefore repair anything in any part of my limb of my body goes wrong. I do not know how to repair it, but Krishna can do it because He is the owner. Rishi Kesha, Rishi Kesha, Rishi Kena, Rishi Kesha, Sevanam Bhakti Vidya. You have to pay to the owner. Similarly, we have to serve Krishna for occupying this body. That is devotion. Just like the karma is not true, no karma is also wrong. Because it is also explained, sabato pani padasto. Sabato pani padasto means everywhere the supreme Lord has got His hands and legs. So what is that? How He has got hands and legs? Your hands, my hands, they are hands of Krishna. Therefore, it should be used for Krishna. Just like your hands, so you are claiming this is my hand. This hand is used for my service. So, uh, if you uh, want to eat something, uh, you use your hand for eating, but for others. Eating, you don't use your hand. He uses his own. This is an example. So all these hands and legs belong to Krishna. It should be used for Krishna. That is called bhakti. Rishi ke na rishi ke sa seva na bhakti chhe. If you don't use, uh, then that is. Are against the laws of nature. So, what does Krishna do? Krishna, the super soul, is onubanta. Onubanta means without his permission, he cannot do anything. 
อีกนั้นด้วยนี่ because every day belongs to Krishna how we can use something without permission so all of us uh, and who was the star just like father and son little child Uh, he wants to do something and wants permission from the father or the mother, and he gives. In our childhood, I remember that even for going to the privy, I wanted permission of my mother. Can I go? That is nature. That is nature. Uh, Mother is not restricting me. But still, I am asking the permission of mother. Can I go? Can I go? I remember it. Uh, this is natural. Uh, <coughs> Similarly, we cannot do anything without the permission of the super soul within the heart. Sarvastha chaham ridisamni vishya matas mitigyana mahuhana. Uh, without permission, that for his arogamta. So when we do something wrong, how Krishna as Anta Jani as Paramatma gives permission? This is this question may be there, but he gives permission when I do something wrong because I cannot do anything without his permission. But he gives me permission. Uh, अरे कारणम गुण संघर्ष देट इज ऑलरेडी एक्सप्लेन पुरुषा प्रकृतिस्थ ही भूमते प्रकृति जान गुणा कारणम गुण संघर्ष सदसद जन्म जो ही कैन गिव यू परमिशन बट दी एंजॉयमेंट एंड सफरिंग विल हैव टू बी टेकन बाय यू यू इंसिस्ट परमिशन I want to do this, and without permission you cannot do it. Therefore, Krishna gives you the right to do it, but at your risk. Oh. Krishna does not want that you should do it, but you want to do it. Therefore, he gives permission. He wants sarvadharman paritajjamami kamusaro. That is his demand, but your demand is different. That I shall not surrender, sir. I want to do this. All right, you do it at your own risk. But if you follow the instruction of Krishna, then he takes charge of you. Om Kaur Sarva Pavi Bhuma Krishna. So you do pap or punna, you enjoy the effect. But when you follow the instruction of Krishna. There is no such papa punna. It is uh, transcendental. Brahma, that is called Brahma. And above the gunas, sabunam samudit tayitan Brahma bhuyaya. Mancha bhavi chari ni bhakti jyoti na jasi. Krishna says, anyone who is in this. And then they are in service unto me. What do you mean? Sarunam samutit tayitan brahma bhuya kalpate. He is not affected by the activities. He is immune from the result of all activities. Many places it is said. Jagyate karma natra lubham karma bandha. If you want to do for your satisfaction, Krishna will give you permission. But he will have to enjoy and suffer the effects. Karma na adi yone trim. It is very simple to understand. So therefore, Krishna is called Anubanta, giving permission. Yes, you can do it. You can do it. Anubanta o gurusta. And so far our activities are concerned. This is also. Explained in the Upanishad that there are two birds in this tree body. 
One is observing and another is enjoying. So the uh, observing bird is the Paramatma, Krishna. He Upadrishta, he is simply seeing your activities, how you are doing, and giving the effect. And all of them. Uh, he does not want it. Uh, what you are doing now, Krishna does not want it. But because he wanted persistently to do it, so he needs permission. Because without his permission you cannot do it. This is the condition. Upadrishtana on tāsya. Bhakta. He is the maintainer. Uh, he cannot get anything without his mercy. Uh, there may be ample supply of necessities of life by the grace of Krishna, and there may be scarcity. Uh, so they are now complaining about overpopulation. There is no question of overpopulation. Krishna is quite competent, able to maintain everyone. But as you become godless, as you become disobedient to the laws of God, there will be restriction. You cannot have full supply of necessities of life. That time has already come. All these rascals, God makes rascals, uh, they are now suffering. The only remedy is to become devout. In Bhakta, he can maintain many millions. There is no question of overpopulation. He can maintain Bhakta. But nature will not supply. Nature is restrict supply if you become godly. Therefore, nature is very strong, strict. They will jesa guna vain, mamo maya dhuruttaya. Elastic supply. So in this Kaviju, people are degrading, and the supply also will be reduced. There will be no supply of milk, there will be no supply of sugar. That is stated in the Srimad Bhagavad. There will be no supply of rice, no supply of wheat. Now you can get black market, white market, but time is coming when there will be no supply. Completely. Uh, he will force to eat this bee. Now it is opening big shop, big, big, big shop. This time has already come gradually, and it will be increasing. Unless you take to Krishna consciousness, Kittanādeva Krishna Samukta Saṅgha Parampadeva Kalau Dosa Nidhi Rāja Nasti Dhīpa Mahārja This Kalijo is suffering. So, you cannot get comfortable life in this Kalijo being Godness. Because Kalijo means Godness. Mandāsa Mandra Matai Mandra Bhādhyā Jivadhyata so therefore, everyone should take to Krishna consciousness to save himself from the onslaught of Kali which will increase day by day. Thank you very much.